Unified Manager provides you with RESTful endpoints allowing you to automate your operational monitoring needs. In this video, we will see how you can leverage Unified Manager APIs to create custom reports. Each Unified Manager instance comes with built-in um, documentation to help you understand all the supported APIs. Now to create reports, you need to know your Unified Manager credentials and the right APIs to use in your report logic as a prerequisite. You can use the uh, API documentation to understand the APIs and its use cases. Use any programming language of your choice to extract data from the APIs and format the report. For the demo, we have used a VB script that feeds Unified Manager Volume APIs to draw processed health and performance information. To be able to run the script manually, we have embedded the script with MS Excel. That way, you can use a forms feature to key in Unified Manager credentials, thereby gaining access to the Unified Manager database. You have the option to either run the script manually or schedule it as per your business needs. For scheduling purposes, you can use Windows Scheduler or SharePoint in conjunction with a batch file that contains Unified Manager credentials. You may use other schedulers as supported by your programming language and your hosted environment. The script uses volume APIs as shown here and formats the data gathered so you can export the report as PDF or XLS vis vis providing you the ability to send them as email attachments in the supported formats. The script requires a destination directory to store the report. Open the developer tab in MS Excel and key in Unified Manager's IP address and directory structure in the code. Now we are ready to run the script manually or via scheduler. To run the report, or to run the script manually, we created the generated underscore reports directory. Now click on the XLSM file that has the script embedded and navigate to the developer tab to open the code. On clicking the developer tab, we click on view code and edit uh, uh, the parameters like uh, um url etc and then click on forms run the forms to key in uh, the user uh, unified manager credentials click on the uh, su uh, supported uh, formatted output formats and then click on to generate email now the reports are generated uh, as a report uh, in, in the, direct, uh, the destination directory as CSV and PDF. Clicking on the PDF, we see um, all the capacity and performance information for the volumes. The same has also been sent uh, to, e uh, to the email recipient in both the formats. We'll click on the CSV only to see similar report that we have viewed earlier. Now let's look at how we can automate this process. For this, um, uh, we will use a batch file. In the batch file, we already keyed in uh, uh, user ID and password for the UM. Uh, on, on running the script, it triggers the on running the batch file. It triggers the script, and uh, on successful run, it generates this uh, reports that that are sent as, even as emails. You can uh, use this approach with any programming language to generate operational reports. Thank you.